Hola, amigos. Mi nombre es Kevin. Uh, today, we're going to work on this uh, Epson WF4730. We're going to show you how to take the scanner off and the panel off and the top layer off. So you'll be able to access the internal of the printer for further troubleshooting and the repair. At first, we turn back to the printer, take off the duplexer, and uh, take off the waste tank. I'll use the term life, right? Uh, top and bottom, uh, which I refer when I'm facing the front of the printer. Left is left, right is right. So now, actually, I'm looking at the back. So basically, if I say right, that means on the left on, on this picture. It's the same thing if I go to fly fishing. Uh, when I say left of the stream, means i facing upstream. Left is left. So by the way, the state of Colorado, you got your signs wrong. This printer has a left panel and a right panel. Each panel in the back, you have uh, three screws. So one, two, and uh, there's another screw there. So don't do anything before you find the third screw. And then there's a uh, one screw in the middle. So three on each, each side, uh, one in the middle. And then now I'm working on the left side of the panel. And uh, one, two, three, three screws. And each panel will have one screw underneath and the other side. Once total of four screws removed, each panel is pretty easy, just peel it off. And this is the left side. Now we're going to remove the top plate by remo removing the four screws on the top. If you have a short uh, driver bed, you can just remove this screw. Otherwise, you can wait until we remove, remove the hinge. There's one screw on the hinge, and uh, then you can just use the finger to separate the hinge. And then remove the two screws on the edge of the printer. Uh, lift the LCD panel and uh, remove the two screws. And now you can just take off the top cover. Every time you're going to disconnect any cables, take a picture. See the scanner is connected with a one ground wire, a three cable wire, and a two FFC cables. Take a picture and write down the note of the color of the wire. And if it's FFC cable, you probably want to write where the green side is pointed towards. So it will help you to reinstall it. If any time uh, you find a uh, uh, you'll find a, a mystery cable, you don't know where to plug it into, go to bchtechnology.com and looking for your printer model. And uh, for for example, WF4730 note. So there we have a note on the main board and uh, it'll have a picture and show you uh, which cable, what kind of cable to plug it into. So take a picture or it costs you. See here is, uh, I write down on my note every cable I'm going to touch and uh, compare with the picture. Once you disconnect the cable, you can just leave the scanner straight up and uh, that's it. I hope you enjoyed this video. Visit us at www.bchtechnology.com or locally at Greensboro, North Carolina. Cheers.